a very small proportion of preclinical animal research studies benefit patients. We would like to change that. I am Kurunchi Gurusamy, Professor of Evidence-Based Medicine at University College London. I conceptualized and led this project to design a domain-based tool to assess whether the findings of a preclinical animal research study can be translated into improvement in the management of human diseases. Only a small proportion of preclinical animal research translates into clinical benefit in humans. Possible reasons for this include the design, conduct, and the reporting of preclinical studies. Your domain-based tool assesses different factors that impact the outcome of interest and are preferred by methodologists to assess clinical studies. There is currently no formal domain-based assessment of the clinical relevance of preclinical research. We created a tool that provides a framework for researchers, journal editors, grant funders, and regulatory authorities to assess the potential clinical relevance of preclinical animal research. This can help in improving the design of the preclinical animal studies, help the journal editors and grant funders in making decisions about publication or funding of preclinical animal research, and help the regulatory authorities in deciding whether there is sufficient justification to perform a first in human study. We conducted a Delphi process of scored ranking over successive rounds to arrive at a consensus among experts on what aspects of a preclinical animal research study indicate that its results are likely to be translated into improvement in the management of human diseases. It was a big challenge to bring a group of experts together to contribute to the development of the tool and agree on the aspects that are to be included in the tool. We did this using online methods and reminders to gather their input on what elements were necessary. We also revised the words and examples until everyone was satisfied with the words and content. This involved several iterations. Our tool has eight domains and a total of 28 signaling questions that can help stakeholders evaluate the clinical relevance of the preclinical research study. We are currently piloting this tool to improve it and plan to recruit 50 researchers performing or planning to perform preclinical animal studies or clinical studies to assess the clinical relevance of their preclinical research. We will provide training materials and depending upon the feedback, we'll consider refining the assessment framework. We would like future preclinical research studies to be clinically relevant. We recommend that stakeholders use the tool to improve the design of the preclinical animal research, approve or fund preclinical animal studies that are likely to be translated into improvement in the management of human diseases. More detailed information on the development and use of the tool can be found in our recently published PRJ article. We also have additional learning materials available and viewers can help with piloting the tool. If you are interested in helping with this piloting process, please send me an email.